I didn't want to do all of the um, all of the sort of traditional uh, New Orleans stuff. The you know the the the, uh, the funeral processions and 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 a lot of uh, although I did shoot a little bit in the uh, in the French Quarter, I didn't want to beat it over the head. Um, so that was something that was important for me that it didn't become a kind of a tourist guide um, for New Orleans. Although I hope you get a taste for it. I mean, I like the bridge, for example, at the beginning. There's a mar I forgot. I don't know what the name of the bridge is, but but it's it, it's terrific, and and it's it's um, going over the river, so you get a sense of deep water, if you like, at the beginning of the movie. You know, the, this, 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 there's a nice sort of, well, it's a, a drone shot, you know, coming upwards. It just uh, um, moves upwards. I enjoyed working with Janine, enormously, Janine Opperwall. Um, and we went to this house, and I love the floorboards. It's a bizarre thing to say. But what was great was that there was no carpets in this place. There was just these lovely floorboards. So I sort of chose the location because of the floorboards. It was, it was, and we didn't put any carpets down. I just thought it was sort of, as a look, I thought it was interesting. It had a great staircase, an outside staircase, sort of where at the beginning of the movie, she goes up the entire stair staircase and get, turns right. And he goes halfway up the staircase and turns left. So you have a distinct feeling that they're living in different parts of the, ha of the house. Ben's a terrific actor. Um, what I liked was his willingness to play somebody who was <coughs> unlike, you know, normally I see him as sort of a bullion and outgoing and, and, and he was prepared for me to make this guy so a fairly introvert guy who is vulnerable and still and different really from a lot of the parts that he had played previously. And I thought it was very brave of him to, to do that. At times he said to me, he said, um, it's not in my DNA this is to do this. But it, but it was, it was, and I think I, I'm really proud of him. All I really like after a film is that, uh, that I've made is that, they, is that they will discuss it, that they won't necessarily agree, but I love the fact that they won't forget it by the next day, you know, or by dinner or whatever. And I've been lucky because I made a, a few movies where where that's happened, you know, they have, they're still talking about fatal attraction now, for example, or, I don't know, nine and a half weeks. So I've got lucky, and I hope that'll be the case with this, because I think it's very eccentric, the movie, and, and I, I feel lucky to have made it, you know, because it is weird. I mean, it is weird.